How's it going everyone, it's Gadgets Boy and I am excited to bring you an unboxing of the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. Um, I've been contemplating whether to get one or not but eventually uh, I kind of uh, settled down and I thought yeah I'd get one and see what it's all about So uh, because it's got all sorts of good reviews online so I thought I'd check it out myself and bring you my review eventually. So um, just looking on the back here, so it's uh, LTE ready, you got a 2.3 gigahertz quad core processor, uh, you got full HD uh, Super AMOLED display and that's 5.7 inch uh, of a display. So uh, full HD recording and playback as well at 1080p. You got 13 megapixel autofocus camera. Uh, that's the primary camera. And on the front one, you've got two megapixel camera. GPS, uh, it's there as well. You got three gigs of RAM. You got your stylus pen with the S Pen features. Uh, you got smart remote, so you can use it as a remote control. And you got 3200 mAh battery, so you got a big battery in there. The quad core processor, I believe, is a Snapdragon 800, if I'm right. This is the 32 gig variant. Uh, of course, you can expand it with a micro SD card up to 64 gig. The camera in there is capable of recording 4K videos at 30 frames per second. And if you do standard 1080p, you can do up to 60 frames per second. So, anyway, let's get inside this and see what uh, we get inside the packaging. So. Uh, is the Samsung Galaxy Note 3 straight away greeted by the regular packaging that you get with the uh, new Samsung Galaxy range? Uh, we we'll see what's underneath here first before we go through the rest. So you got your uh, quick start guide, so you can give that a read if you like the boring stuff. Uh, you get your charger in here as well. Of course, I'm in the UK, so I get the three pin charger. You also get your battery, of course, the old 3200 mAh battery in there. Really big battery. And you also get your USB charging cable and your headphone as well. Of course, the headphones got inline remote control and control for listening to music and all that stuff and microphone. So we'll put that to the side for a second. Uh, just before I finish, uh, you've also got uh, this cable here, which is slightly different now. So this is a USB 3.0 cable. So that allows for quicker charging, so faster charging and faster uh, data transfer. So you, when you need to transfer data and sync your data with your phone, uh, that will happen quicker. Uh, so this tool here is for replacing the stylus tip, I believe. Uh, I'm not totally sure, but there's a tool there for doing something. It would be in the quick start guide anyway to figure what that is about. Uh, so this is the black edition. So you can also get in a variety of colors and some other accessories out there. So we take off the back plate and you get this uh, Fox lever. Uh, sort of finishing on the back to give you that premium look, the old school notebook look. And it's got this scare, uh, this uh, stitching here going on around it. I'm not sure if that's a real stitching or not, but never mind, it looks great. That's all that matters. And you've also got your stylus here. So that's your S Pen. So we'll put that back in there. And you've got Samsung logo. You've got your 13 megapixel camera on the back with LED flash uh, next to it there. Uh, the phone feels really light without the battery in there yet, so uh, we see what it feels like once the battery goes in. Uh, so you got your headphone port at the top with uh, IR Blaster just next to it there for your remote control stuff. On the side, you got your power button, and on the bottom, you got your uh, USB 3.0 charging port. You can also charge it with a standard micro USB cable if you've got one already. And there's your speaker again, the stylus there, the microphone next to it, and your volume rocker on the other side of the phone. Uh, I'm a big fan of Galaxy Note range. I've always had one. If you look at my channel, I've done a review and an unboxing, even from the first ever one that came out. So uh, you can always check those out to see how far they've come. So to take that apart, just simply just pop that, pry that open uh, carefully. So don't snap it open. So looking underneath here, this is where your micro SD card will go to add, as well as your uh, SIM card slot just underneath the same place. So uh, you'd need to take the battery out to change your SIM card all the time but you don't need to take the battery out to get to your uh, memory card slot. Uh, let's just pop the battery in there and give this uh, first boot. So here we are with the first booting up. So you get your process there, welcome. You hit a lot of next and next. There's no SIM card in there. Uh, so I'll have to sort of register this using my Wi-Fi and stuff. I'm just gonna give that a quick uh, setting up now. So here we go. Okay, so while we're setting that up, you can see on the front there, you got your sensors there, you got your front speaker grill, you got your front facing camera, a two megapixel camera, uh, which is capable of doing, which is capable of recording HD videos as well. You got your t uh, button there in the middle, and then you got two capacitive touchscreen button there that would uh, eliminate uh, when you need to use them as well. So we can automatically set the date and time. Click next. I understand. Skip. No, no, 
So here we are. So once you fully uh, set up everything, you see this uh, beautiful display here. So this is a 386 PPI display and it's Super AMOLED Full HD display. Uh, you can see the beauty of it. It looks really sharp. The colors are quite vivid as well. You can see how fluid it is as well, just moving around the displays and uh, things like that. So it's pretty cool. Um, Again, there's loads of things to, to talk about on the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. So I'll probably bring you a, lot, a series of videos over the coming weeks and stuff. And uh, also be sure to check out gadgetsboard.co.uk, which is where I, I'm going to have the full uh, written review of this Samsung Galaxy Note 3. But anyway, there it is, guys. Do let me know what you guys think. Uh, leave a comment below. Make sure you hit the subscribe button as well if you haven't subscribed already. And uh, I'll be sure to bring you uh, a another unboxing as well of the LG G2, which is another really hot topic in the Android world, Android scene at the minute. So I'm going to unbox that as well. Uh, so do look out for the video for that. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.